Powhatan are gonna utilize animal skins to make most of their clothing out of. So they would use animal skins like we use any kind of fabric. So they'd make their clothes out of it, their shoes, cover-ups for the wintertime, blankets. Um, and they're all gonna be from the native animals that are in Virginia. So the white-tailed deer is the herd animal that we have here. So white-tailed deer is gonna predominantly be what they're making a lot of their clothing out of. The deer is gonna be skinned with stone knives and uh, while it's still fresh, while it's still wet, they're gonna go through a process of scraping off the membrane on the side that's attached to the meat and scraping off the hair on the other side if they're gonna be making leather like what I'm wearing out of it. So once that's all scraped down and you're down to um, just the actual dermis layer, the skin layer, it's gonna be soaked in a solution of the brain of the animal. So the brain's gonna be mixed up with a little bit of water and those fats and oils in the brain are gonna be uh, worked into the hide. So you're gonna soak it, get it completely wet with the brain. In order to keep it from washing out when it gets wet, it's gonna be smoked afterwards and the smoke will help solidify the whole process and keep the, the oils from washing back out again. Occasionally you might decide you don't want to scrape the hair off, especially if you're making bedding or something for winter to keep you warm. So what you're gonna do is just scrape the back side, the side that attaches to the animal and scrape that membrane off and you'll tan it just from the back side. So rather than going through that whole scraping process, you're just working it from one side with the brain in it as it's drying.